Listen, I was driving down the street praising the Lord. I had to pull over and share this. Out of my spirit came the phrase triumphant victories. Those of you who are waiting for vengeance to be served by the Lord, for exoneration even of your name, of your character, the Lord is doing it right now. Triumphant victory. This is a loud, joyful victory. Loud meaning that, yes, it will ripple through the atmosphere. You don't have to, my God, you don't have to put your victory on display because God's going to do it. You don't have to tell everybody because God's going to do it. He's exalting you in this, in this season. And as I was saying triumphant victories, I began to decree that every open door that the Lord has opened, no man can close it. And every closed door that the Lord has closed, no man can open it. And all those closed doors, the doors that you shut on relationships, the doors that you shut on sin, the doors that you shut, they're all sealed, my God, with the blood of the lamb. There's like a stamp I see in the spirit, like, a, uh, um, like an emblem and it's sealed shut. Nobody can open. It's like steel is how I see it right now. It's like a steel stamp. My God, help me, Lord. I pray this makes sense. So you get ready for your exoneration. You get ready for your triumphant victory and to walk through every open door. Do not fear it. Nobody can close these doors. These doors that the Lord is opening, your door of marriage, your door of business, your door of ministry, your door of career, your door of your new beginning, the new thing, you moving out of state, whatever it is, nobody can close it. Don't fear it in the mighty name of Jesus. Walk through it. Triumphant victories. Your name is being redeemed. Your reputation is being redeemed. Your shame is being redeemed in this hour, right now, right now, right now. My God, walk forward in the mighty name of Jesus.